So, uh, first of all, I want to apologize if the sound is, uh, my speech microphone is a little bit different. I'm away for a week, but uh, I have my PlayStation with me, so I'm recording these episodes while I'm away. This is a little bit of a boring place, so <laughs> that's why this uh, it's with me. So, yeah sounds maybe a little bit different and uh, probably they I don't know the video should be the same but anyway let's continue as you saw on the intro I bought the uh, trailer and also I bought the chicken feed for quite a bit so they that will be sorted for quite a while but first we need to repair this guy you know it's edit five percent of damage and uh, I'm not sure how damaged this is but we are going to prepare it and uh, yeah uh, November 11th and I did manage to clear this whole <laughs> list away only the bailing contract but I'm not gonna do it right now maybe a little bit later but then it's just this will be pretty expensive I believe so first of all the front loader yeah five and a half thousand oh four seven seven not bad okay so that is now fixed so um, yeah we need uh, obviously a power washer at the farm yeah but uh, one thing we are going to buy is the uh, prune. We need that. We are going to start start the um, our taking care of the uh, our you know these um, grape wines. So sixteen thousand. I don't think this there's in sale. Yeah, the only that was there. So. We are going to get this guy here, and we're gonna just. Uh, we probably need to buy it. We're gonna use it a lot, so yeah. So not a mo not much money left. We're gonna take it with us at the same time. Oh yeah, Oop. let's take it like so. Yeah, two flies at one hit. 
so uh, what else were there? Yeah, I was thinking about the uh, crates, you know, what are the benefits for that? And uh, I was thinking that one of the benefits probably is that uh, we don't have to use our land for those, you know, the fields. So that is probably one of the biggest benefits and also with the Orioles but I was a little bit stupid that I planted the Orioles on the field so they couldn't be more so planted to the hill and uh, maybe <laughs> use that field for the crops but uh, yeah I'm not gonna change it no. our plans but, uh, yeah, I will put by the field number seven and uh, put olives on that also. But uh, yeah, the crops will be extended to another piece of property that we could probably buy. And uh, today we are going also going to uh, finish our production chain with the uh, lumber so that is one purchase we're gonna do and uh, as you saw also I have been deliver delivering uh, wood to the sawmill and uh, I think we have something about 9000 liters over there now and uh, it's going slowly down so we are not in a hurry to, to get more so we can but at that time we can uh, cut those trees down and deliver those and uh, I am going to on this forest bit here I am going to cut this also down and we are gonna use that lumber over there so I think we could have uh, quite a bit of money when uh, before the spring so that would be a great thing Let's leave this right here now. So, as you can see, I did a little decoration here, landscaping for the chickens. I think it looks pretty sweet. And the eggs are coming in a lot more, lot more than the uh, in the other coop. And uh, yeah, they got little shadow over here, and a couple of trees are placed here. So uh, I've spent about three and a half thousand on this landscaping and also put a couple of trees behind the uh, house there. And also this I missed totally. So we have here nice uh, control panel. So we can actually lower and raise the curtains. So now they're shut and we can open during the day. And it, there's also a curtain over there. So. I don't know if the probably the uh, roof also open. Haven't checked it. Yeah, and one thing was uh, this this uh, garden thing. I totally mis have misunderstood the uh, storing thing. So I thought that when these are full, you need to get it, get them off of there to. Uh, get more so as in FS90 with the sea wool and things like that but obviously that's not the case because when the, when it's full it just starts to use the storing feature right here so <laughs> I was that was unnecessary to to uh, load them over here so yeah live and learn but uh, I think we're gonna sell these guys away now. So, because, oh, we gotta put the gear on because I'm a manual. Let's put, let's put high on there, right? Yeah. So, good. let's go over here and sell this stuff away. Let's see how much we can get. Looking good. Three thousand. Okay, I'll take that. So, uh, 
obviously we are going to store this now to the uh, storage which is in the garden so I don't have to worry about <laughs> lifting those to the trailer and we can use the, use the trailer and the uh, hill over there with the little bits and pieces of wood so yeah that is probably the wisest thing maybe we can leave it this one just over here okay so um, what will we do next yeah, we are going to mulch this grass also. I think it's, uh, yeah, we need to, and also start the plowing and we will see just the, uh, this, uh, what is it, uh, the uh, subsoiler, does it work on the plowing state that we need? Yeah, so uh, first things first, let's go to the uh, let me see on my list. Do we have here anything for you to catch up? I think that was it. Yeah, so let's head to the town. I have a truck on the uh, next collectible and we will get that. And after that we are going to get the carpentry. So we can uh, start getting that lumber. The, uh, uh, what was it? <laughs> what? Planks. We can get planks there. So we are able to manufacture the, uh, the uh, furniture. As we, if we take a look here, that is really high price. So it's uh, on the uh, summertime, it's going high, but I think we are uh, in the position that we need to sell those immediately. So 3,600. So that is great. So that'll probably be around five to six thousand when when we are approaching summer. So I will see you at the truck. Alright, so here we are. Just in the middle of the town. Just in the, the I think there's some kind of main street this. And there's this park here. And I find, found this one here. Here it is. Wheat gobbler. I wish, <laughs> wish that it would be written it with the C. <laughs> yeah. So eight more to go. Thank you very much. So we can use that money now to get the carpentry. Yeah, and um, I'm really really looking forward to get some mods and uh, just uh, you know continue my vintage survival on Elk Creek and a little bit more older stuff in this game but uh, we will head back to the uh, carpentry now and, and uh, let's purchase that and we can start start uh, getting the those planks to the uh, furniture factor so I will get the case also with the front loader over there and let's check how that goes okay so we are here at Henry's carpentry workshop and I think this is 60,000 by yes we are going to purchase it thank you I have not much money left but I think this will be a great business for the winter. So if we take a look here now, we have planks and uh, 3,600 liters on the storage. So these are 1,000 liter pallets. Yeah, so these will go obviously yeah, here. And, uh, furniture will spawn over there so this is pretty convenient that's, that these are just by each other so let's take our first pallet and test it out so, I think 
next one will need the respawn there. All oh, these posts are not full. Yeah, but we went in. And let's take a look at here. So, uh, oh, we got, uh, oh, we, we also, yeah, okay, okay, so we can uh, deliver wood here also. So probably we need to do that. 36 of wood comes 45 of furniture. All right, okay, okay. So planks we got 999 liters and okay. So I think well, I need to deliver wood here also. Yeah, so two places need wood. I will deactivate this now for now. Before before I get one one load delivered here. Okay, it was uh, interesting to so probably we can just put these guys here. Maybe we should at some point we should probably get the forklift on this on this facility here. I think so. Is that fully already the one? But we can put it over there. Yeah, and, uh, and I tested a little bit about you know putting the gardens to. Uh, uh, straight sailing, but uh, I think it's pretty expensive to sell the delivery fee or some some sort because I I got the percentage of uh, maybe a little bit under forty percent or something like that. It's getting less money, so obviously I'm not gonna do that because our delivery point is just beside us. So. You can correct me if I'm wrong, but it seems really, really high. So it's probably best just to do it manually. But the, uh, the other option was the, uh, which we could probably use in here, is the, uh, hang on, the uh, selling, uh, no, distributing. But I have to test it, test it on in here because it would obviously go to the carpet here. But uh, I'm not sure how much that that cost. But, uh, I will test it off camera. So these are going in. We got uh, wood on the sawmill, and uh, we have. Uh, Blanks on here, 5,000 liters. So we will just wait and see that the furniture is coming in. And yeah, exciting times. I like these production chains here. So, uh, what next? I think we are going to back to the farm and uh, start taking care of our vines and I will probably deliver that wood of camera here and yeah that's a little bit of boring part but yeah I will see you back at the farm okay so we are here back at the farm and let's start, start testing out now the yeah. vine team so I think we will start with those olives here and uh, check out this. So obviously this mulcher doesn't do anything but uh, get gets the grass away. So we have to wait for this. And it starts start mulching here. Doesn't do anything but Oh, why doesn't it do anything on here? 
This is now okay. Let's see on the uh, that can we actually harvest grass? Yes, we can. I, I don't know what, what's going on with that because it, it's it mulches on the uh, the side of the field, obviously. Okay. <laughs> No, oh, this is getting uh, really strange. Let's try the cultivator now and see first. That's that. And let's take a look over here now. Now, where we are, we are here. So, it's plowing. Yes, we do. That is probably unnecessary. Yeah, it doesn't show line. So we will get now the soft solar here. Uh, this is a little heavy maybe we could take that weight with us. Okay. Try number two. No, <laughs> not the way down. This guy. Okay, do something now, please. What in the name? What the hell is going on here now? So obviously, oh shoot, does it need to be on the spring there, that I'm, I'm not able to do this now, let's try here, first, oh man, so it does over here, what, 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 So confused with this. Wow. Let's try in the middle. I thought that it would just work, but why it doesn't work on the grapes? Let's see. Yeah, it shows there. No, but it shows there now also. Where is it? Over here. Or do I need to just go between? On this side? Let's try it. Just go in the middle. Once. I don't think this does anything. Oh, come on, I'm stuck now. Well, actually, it does probably. Might. I don't know, I don't know, I don't think so. Oh, I don't know. Let's go. Let's go now. Just like we saw the whole world. Some light. Yeah, it 
doesn't seem to do anything at all. And it starts to the area. Okay. So let's get the cultivator for the subsoil. Yeah, I don't know if this this is just correct for maybe maybe this is unnecessary at this point of year. Maybe I will do this in, you know, during the spring time. Yeah. That is pretty strange, but I cannot see where I'm going with this, so... Maybe, maybe the grass will die during the winter and, you know, it just get those vines pruned, but let's try here on this road first, do the whole row, row here. Yeah, it changes on this. Yeah. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I think we need to wait for the spring. So I think that we need to, on the middle part, we need to go two times. Yeah, this is obviously works here, but, but what's the deal with the others? Okay. So that is obviously loud now. Yeah. Uh, doesn't need plowing, this needs plow. But uh, what about here? Doesn't need plowing. Needs plow. No, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Ah uh, we will we'll handle this during the spring. That's what we are going to do. Yeah, so... And probably the... Uh, because we don't have any fertilizing state on here now. Yeah. And we obviously cannot fertilize it before... Uh, before we, we subsoil it. Okay, so... Let's try the pruning. How does the, that work? Maybe we will do that for the grapes now in the winter and do the uh, those uh, groundwork later. So this is pretty interesting. How does this work? Lower here, here, and uh, I think we need to unfold it. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, uh, turn it on. Do we need to uh, somehow adjust it or just drive? Oh, just drive. Okay. Okay, so this needs to be done. That's pretty easy. <laughs> so yeah, so that I know that this needs to be done so Okay, we are learning learning to be a great farmer. <laughs> so I think uh, this will be today's episode and we will okay, so now you stop right there. Yeah, I will continue with the pruning and uh, and we will do these things groundwork on the spring and uh, cut down those those uh, trees over there and maybe move on to the forest before the bear I don't know what else is to do during the winter. Yeah the furniture <laughs> obviously so I think I will see you when we have something to sell from the uh, carpentry so let's see how much money we can get out of that yeah thanks for watching and I will see you later I'm sorry about the sounds bye bye